Hey, welcome back. This is Chef Aldis. And today we're going to do a special dish. We're going to use filet mignon. We're going to use fontina cheese and prosciutto. So we got two medallions of filet mignon right here. This is called filet mignon tornados fontina. Filet mignon tornados fontina. So here we go. We're going to season the meat. I'm going to take our black pepper. I always like to use fresh pepper and crush it just like that. Okay, we're going to season the steaks. This is filet mignon. This is ridiculously good. It's very expensive, but it's good. It's a luxury, you know. You can do it once in a while. Okay, so we got our filet mignon. I'm going to take it over here. I always use sea salt. Coarse sea salt. See the crystals? All right. So we got this going. As usual, a real hot frying pan here, saute pan. So we're going to hit it with some Evo. I'm going to put the fillets right in there, just like that. Let them sear. All right. Okay, our filet mignons are going here. You want to sear it nicely on both sides. And the sauce that we're going to use in this is going to have mushrooms. Brandy again. A little bit of Dijon mustard. And a little bit of butter. And of course, the old demi glaze. We call this sauce Espanol sauce with a veal reduction. All right, so we got our filet mignon going right here. See how nicely it is, nice and seared? It's about rare right now. All right, so we're gonna take it right off the fire. We're gonna put it right on here. This is filet mignon fontina. All right, so we got two medallions of filet mignon or tornados of filet mignon. This is luxury. This is nothing better than this. Take some prosciutto. I'm going to put some on top, just like this. I actually got four star review one time because of this dish. This is what put me on the map. All right. We're going to use our Fantina cheese. This is from France. Fromage du Francais. Fontina cheese. Okay. So we got it on there just like that. It's going to go in the oven for about three to four minutes, a real hot oven. So I'm just going to throw it right in there and here it goes. Meantime, we're going to develop a nice sauce for this. This is a veal reduction espanol sauce. So we're going to start off with a little butter and shallots. And we're going to cook this off just a little bit. And we're going to use these pan, pan juices also for this sauce. So here it goes. Like that. We've got some uh, nice cremini mushrooms. A nice handful in there, just like that. A little bit of Evo. Okay. We want to get these mushrooms nice and sauteed. Get all the liquid out of them. It's going to go right into the sauce. All right. It's brandy time. Brandy. All right, let's check out the, the mushrooms. See the mushrooms? They're nicely sauteed, browned off. You gotta saute this dish with the shallots. It's got that nice aroma. So we're gonna add some, uh, some cognac. And here we go. Woo! This is my favorite part. Look at this. Wow. And we're going to reduce this by half. This liquid in there, it's going to get reduced by half. So here it goes. Let's check out our filet mignon in the oven. And this is what we're looking for. The medallions, see the cheese, the cheese is nicely melting into it. The prosciutto is getting hot. So it's almost done. Another minute in there. And we're done. <clears throat> Here's our sauce. It's getting there. I'm going to add some demi glaze right in there, just like that. And just a tad of tomato paste. Just a little tad. Just like that. 
going to give a nice color. Once again, we're looking for that color. We're looking for that beautiful presentation. All right. I'm going to let this reduce a little bit. And we're going to do the ratatouille. This is the ratatouille mix. You got, we got the baby eggplant, mushrooms, onions, zucchini, green, yellow, chopped garlic in there, fresh garlic, nice hot pan. All this stuff is going to go right in there. In this case, we're going to use some fresh rosemary too in there. Ratatouille going. Look at it. There's beautiful colors in there. That's what we're looking for. The tomatoes are starting to uh, melt into it a little bit. And we're going to hit it with a little bit of white wine. Just like that. And our sauce is almost ready. Here's our filet mignon sauce right here. The espanol sauce. And we're going to just finish it off with just a little dab of butter. What that's going to do is going to lighten the sauce. It's going to give it that fresh, light color. That's what we're looking for. I'm going to put it right back in the heat right here. And we're done. Look at the sauce. It's looking good. Looking good. I'm going to throw one of these tomatoes in here just for the color. Let it break off a little bit right in there. Just like that. Our ratatouille is looking good. Look at that. All right. This is what you want your ratatouille to look. All right. That white wine. The aroma from the white wine is incredible. And here's our filet mignon. Oh, take a look at this. The two medallions, tornados. I'm going to take it over here. Okay. Woo! Look at that cheese. Nice and gooey. Wow. That prosciutto. Wow. Okay, this is the other medallion. What we're going to do is we're going to close it like this. Check that out. Okay, this is nice and rare, medium rare, right in there. Okay, look at the juice is coming out. Okay, this is our ratatouille. Ooh, check it out. And the sauce is not even on there yet. Look at this. Check that out. All right. Here we go. All right. Filet mignon fontina. Stuffed with prosciutto, ratatouille, oven baked potatoes. A little bit of parsley. The aroma is incredible. Look at this dish. All right. The chef oldest over and out.